nation. Senator Rubio, you know, you've taken a very different approach to the, the question of Russia. You've called Vladimir Putin a quote, gangster. Why would President Rubio's approach be more effective than President Trump's? Well, first of all, I have an understanding of exactly what it is Russia and Putin are doing, and it's pretty straightforward. He wants to reposition Russia once again as a geopolitical force. He himself said that the destruction of the Soviet Union, the fall of the Soviet Union, was the greatest geopolitical catastrophe of the 20th century. And now he's trying to reverse that. He's trying to destroy NATO. And this is what this is a part of. He is exploiting a vacuum that this administration has left in the Middle East. Here's what you're going to see in the next few weeks. The Russians will begin to fly, fly combat missions in that region, not just targeting ISIS, but in order to prop up Assad. He will also then turn to other countries in the region and say, America is no longer a reliable ally, Egypt. America is no longer a reliable ally, Saudi Arabia. Begin to rely on us. What he is doing is he is trying to replace us as the single most important power broker in the Middle East. And this president is allowing it. That is what is happening in the Middle East. That's what's happening with Russia. Thank and you, Senator Rubio. I want to bring in um, 